Hello friends! Welcome to a new happy learning video. Today we're going to learn about a period of history very important and very revolutionary. Today we're going to learn about the Industrial Revolution. The Industrial Revolution is a stage of history that goes from 1780 to 1850 and began in England. For almost the entire history of mankind Life had been based on agriculture and livestock. At the end of the 18th century, the Englishman James Watt invented, or rather perfected, the steam engine. Until then, the artisans had been dedicated to the manufacturing of utensils with their own hands in small workshop, but with the arrival of the steam engine that changed forever. This machine used the energy of steam to transform it into power and moving other machines. These new machines were applied to the industry and began to do the work that the artisans used to do. So the small artisan workshops were disappearing, giving way to big factories. The steam engine was also used for transport and the first trains and steamboats were manufactured, which facilitated trade and travel between cities and countries. Europe was filled with trains. During the Industrial Revolution, the Royal Society dominated by the nobility stopped being as important as it was, and the urban society dominated by the bourgeois started to appear. The bourgeois were normal people who had become powerful and rich thanks to trade. Since they had a lot of money, they started investing in technology and were the first to build factories. The workers, also called proletarians, were the people who did not have wealth. Not being able to make a living in the countryside or in the villages, they emigrated to the big cities to work in the factories. At first, they worked in very bad conditions and for very little money, meaning that many children had to work on very hard and dangerous tasks so that their families could feed themselves. The workers asked for rights to work in a dignified and safe way, and the owners, the bourgeois, did not want to give it to them. After many conflicts, strikes and fights, the workers managed to make the workday last eight hours and allowed them to rest on Sundays or take vacation days. And also, children were protected so they did not have to work anymore. Today, we continue to use many of these rights and also many of the machines we use are developments of those first steam engines. You already know that knowing the past allows us to understand the present and improve the future. Goodbye friends, until the next video. Ah, and do not forget to subscribe to Happy Learning TV. Search us and subscribe to Happy Learning's YouTube channel.